This unusual leaf is on a very large magnolia. I have only seen it once before several years ago on the same tree in about the same place on the tree. Thanks, this is Lee here in Memphis, Tennessee. So it is an unusual leaf. And you and I are kind of <laughs> going back and forth. I, you know, I think it's a fused leaf, you yeah. know, which I think is probably just a natural occurrence, maybe a natural phenomenon, but. It kind of, it almost looks like it's a fused leaf, but I would, I won't, I, this confused me a lot. I've never seen this in my 37-year yeah, career. I've never seen it either. Never. And I actually sent this picture to uh, my friend who's a, uh, more of a, uh, a fungus-type person okay. at the Morton Arboretum. Uh, she is a professor. Okay, okay. And she's only seen it happen in spores of fungus. Mm. And so this brought up some interest to me. And I found some interesting facts by Dr. Maxwell Masters that he published in 1862. Wow. Yeah. You can see how deep I got into this. I was really interested. All right. Uh, it's either auxiliary, auxiliary or median prolification. Wow. Or prolification. Basically, the leaf, the leaf reproduced itself. Okay. okay. This happens commonly in like bell peppers, where you can cut open a bell pepper and you'll have another smaller bell pepper that grew inside of it. Mm -hmm. So okay. it's basically, it's producing without fertilization or seed so it just it, in a uh, generic sense it, it reproduced itself it grew an extra thumb it grew an, oh <laughs> but you know what but but it, it, you know it looks beautiful you know so i would just keep it i wouldn't worry so much about it right I, no don't yeah, worry about it at all about that. what interests me this about me is what i would love to see the growing site to see what contributes to that soil to that, right or on that side of the tree you know why i, I want to know why just, right. just to have an answer, just, right, right. just for myself, because it's most interesting. It is. Like I said, I've seen many magnolia trees, uh, but I've never seen that before. I haven't either. Yeah, but I, but I think it's kind of cool, so I, yeah, I, I would keep it. So yeah, yeah, uh, a lot of deep research there. <laughs> it is, and uh, he's got some bragging rights there. <laughs> yeah. We hope you enjoyed the video. We have hundreds more. To subscribe, just click below.